Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Pikmin 2 100% No Pikmin Lost Challenge Episode 26. We're in sub-level, what is it, 4 or 5, something like that, of the, what, the Snagret Hole, something to that extent, something to that effect. So we're in another one of these little rusty, rusty little rooms and you can see my needle is kind of freaking out because of that dude. I forgot about these guys. I'm surprised we haven't encountered one yet. Oh my. Yes, things are going to fall from the ceiling. Of course they are. Everyone knows that's my favorite feature of this game. Okay, so I believe the Pikmin will freak out if we, they get stuck in there. Did one just fall off the cliff? Or did he survive? Hopefully he... Oh, okay. There's a slant there. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. We're good. We're all good. So, maybe that's the only treasure? Maybe not? Who knows? I certainly don't know. We'll find out. My treasure meter's back to being normal again now that those guys are... That, that guy is killed. As long as one of them is alive in the room, he will be... Continue to be annoying forever. And just, uh, mucking around with your treasure meter. The Emperor Whistle. It makes sense that he would have one of those. And it looks like we got another treasure here somewhere. Maybe it's buried under the ground, or maybe a guy's gonna fall from the ceiling. Either way, I'm a little frightened. Tell you what, I'm gonna... Oh, Christ! Bad place to do that. I'm having a lot of close calls lately, aren't I? Okay, we're good. We're good. It's all good. Let's just, uh, through here. Hopefully, more things don't fall from the ceiling. Good, we're good. Now let's just, uh... Is it in you? One of you little guys? What are you doing? I want you! Why do you have a treasure? That doesn't... That's, what, that's very weird. It's usually big dudes that have treasures in them. Anyway, that is larger than your body. How did that fit inside of you? Oh well. I'll accept it. It's mine. I don't need those. I'd rather have the Pikmin with me than have the three dollars I'd get from bringing those guys back. So, that should be the last one here, I assume, because I don't see where else he could be unless there's more stuck in guys that fall from the ceiling. But, somehow I doubt it. And I was correct. So, we'll head on down to... Delve Deeper. Sublevel 6. So, are you the final sublevel? I don't think you are. Oh boy, this is going to be a lot of, uh, a lot of poison. And great, more of those things. So, uh, looks like I've got a lot of stuff to knock down. Got a white flower, I guess I'll get the white flower just for, uh, posterity, I guess. We don't really need it for anything, but it's probably good. We don't quite have a hundred white Pikmin, so we might as well, you know, just for, just for kicks. I threw too many. So, we'll just, uh, I'll probably start breaking some of these poisonous things off camera and some of the fences, just so, uh, it's a boring thing to watch, so, yeah, that's what I'll do. I'll break these things all off camera and I'll be back with you when they're all broken. Ah, great. More things fall from the sky. <gasps> oh, no! That's not what I wanted to see. Close call. But we did it. Holy crap. That was scary. Okay, 
So, I was not expecting things to fall from the sky, and I was not expecting that dude to show up out of nowhere. That was more than a little bit scary. So, I had to use two of my hardening bitter sprays, unfortunately. Running low on them. Triple sugar threat. I don't even know what that is. I also don't know what this is. Some sort of device? Heart-like device, maybe? Oh, it's a magnifying glass. I see. That makes that makes sense now that I can see it up close. Okay, so that was very unsettling. There's probably more of them around here too. I also, because of the that dude over there that's me messing around with my needle, I don't even know if that's the last treasure. Oh, it's not. I can see one right over there. So. Uh, looks like I'm probably going to be doing a lot of this on camera, because it's a, it's a scary cave. It suddenly got a whole lot scarier than it was a little while ago. I have a feeling there's a, there's a, there's a bird, it's an aggret, in like the middle of this room, so, uh, no, I'll tell you what, we're going to abuse the strategy we discovered last episode and try to just rush on past him as quickly as we possibly can using all white Pikmin. If there is one here... Oh no, he's gonna come down right in here, isn't he? Oh, good. Go away and stop. Stop doing that. Please. You're really bugging me. Yeah, so your Pikmin do, they kind of run around and scream if <laughs> they get caught up in his antics. Fruit on the bottom. Alright. Not even the last treasure. My goodness! Oh boy! No you don't! Okay, you. No! Oh, he killed it. And lots of dudes are dying. I thought I might have been able to catch him, but I guess not. Okay, I'll reset. Be back with you soon. That one slow Pikmin, man. I was not expecting a uh, snagrit bird dude to just come out of the ground, kind of, uh, you know, in the middle of a hallway like that. I didn't think they would do that. Not this time, bucko. Did we, did we do it? Did we win? We did, somehow. That was pretty... <laughs> that was a tight fight. Tight quarters. Tight and close. Let's not say that. That's gross. I skipped getting those treasures just because I've shown them already, so... There's no real point to doing it again. Okay, where were we? What were we doing? Why were we doing it? No. <laughs> no chances this time. Let's not have a dude spawn behind us, and let's, uh... Let's finish him the right way this time. Yeah. That's how we do it. I hope that was the last one. There was only two that I saw before, so hopefully it's all of them. Uh, this is going to be a while getting across there, so let me do it just uh, off camera.
Okay, so I cut across there and I killed the that annoying dude. And I picked up the lid that was over here, and the last thing is this one clover. I hit these all blue picking because unfortunately there was water in the way. So, I'll be back with you when this one lonely stick is back at the space shuttle. And he's made it back. It's gonna be worth like one, isn't it? Or something silly like that. Twenty. Wow. That was worth it. The science project. Alright. Finally, that's the last one in here, and we have no deaths this time, so we're good to go on to the next level. Let's see, sub-level 7. Are you the bottom? It is the bottom. Okay, this could get dangerous very quickly. This is the boss room, obviously. As usual with the bottom of the sub-level. So we're going to get as many flowers as we possibly can. Now, where is the boss? He'll be in the middle there. Okay, let's do this. I am... He scared me, okay? I just had to do it. Okay, that did not really help that much. Oh, this is not going very well. I am not enjoying this. I can't hit them with anything but yellows. And he's got one in his mouth, so we need to kill him before he eats it. Oh, this is not going to go well. Come on, just a little bit. Okay, we did it. I kind of apologize for, you know, not actually fighting him like a normal person would, and just, uh, <laughs> kind of taking the easy way out, but... Uh, I kind of... I panicked, for one thing, and I, I... Once he once he had one in his mouth, I didn't really have any choice. Unfortunately. I feel bad. I feel bad doing that every single time. But we've got ourselves an armor upgrade. I believe this just makes me tougher against attacks, all of our Louie, that is. A metal this dense defies the laws of physics. How odd to say something like that. Okay, what do we got? I believe... Yeah, okay, that's every single upgrade. Okay, I guess they want you to get fully outfitted before actually heading on over to the final level with the challenging caves. Oh, good, more of this. <laughs> I've been using a lot of it, so it's a good thing it's just giving it to me for free. So, I'll tell you what, I'm going to... Oh, this is everything in here, so I'll just, uh, I'll meet you on the surface then after I check out some of these rooms on uh, off-camera. thousand dollars or four thousand dollars over the uh, the debt that we had to recover so that's good good show four thousand fourteen thousand and one to be completely honest the cave is complete 15 out of 15 treasures that means that means that means this whole area is complete the awakening wood is finished that is the third area we've completed in its entirety. And, uh... I guess that'll be the end of the episode here. The next the next episode we'll head on over to the, uh... The Wistful Wild. And we'll, uh, start getting started on the final level there. The rest of the time here I'll just be spending, for the rest of the day I'll be, uh, collecting some of these things, probably. Off camera, of course. So, thank you everybody for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye-bye.